wishing, hoping. Do you ever find yourself just wishing and hoping for something to be different in your life? For circumstances to change? Praying about it, asking for it, but never doing anything more than that? Hi, I'm Reverend Allie Beerman. I'm so glad you came by to join us today for our gathering of Metaphysical Ministry International. So metaphysical ministry is all about the fact that what you experience with your five senses is less than 1% of the reality that exists. So leave yourself open to the opportunity to go beyond what you hear, taste, smell, and touch, to have a richer experience, to recognize the messages coming to you from the universe, from your higher self, from your guides, from your angels, happens constantly. Allow yourself to recognize the messages because they don't come in just words spoken in your head or a voice booming. Well, I guess they could, but probably not the ones coming at you constantly. We begin every week with a happy share. I have so many happy shares this week. So let me figure out a really big one. I have a neighbor, he's like the most wonderful neighbor in the world, and he's not just this way to me, he's this way to everybody in the whole neighborhood, I mean down all the streets. And he's been doing these amazing things for me that I thought he's been fixing things I couldn't, thought couldn't be fixed. He's been gifting me with all these services that I didn't know were so easy to accomplish. He says he's a jack of all trades and master of none. The guy's brilliant. What he knows, a lot of people calling themselves experts, at least in the areas where he's helped me, they don't even come close to what he knows and does. So I'm so happy, so very happy, so super grateful that he's in my world and it's no accident that I live in this house and he is my neighbor. Now then, what about this hoping for your world to change, wishing for things to be better? You'll never find your answer by looking outside of you. The universe provides synchronistic events for you. It's like a big flashing neon sign saying, take this action. Here's a person who will either help you with what you want or connect you to the person or circumstance that will move you in the direction you want to go. But you gotta take the action. I call it taking divine action because where do you think the messages are coming from? Wake up. You don't have to have a miserable life. You don't have to wake up every morning and say, Good Lord, morning, instead of good morning, Lord. The choice is yours. Now, if you're on the ministry page and you look up there, you'll see all the space for. Is there something in your life you want to manifest? When you put it out to the universe, you put out a thought form, and you know the universe actually responds right away. It may not deliver it to you because it's waiting for you to take action. And it will only deliver what's in your highest and best interest. So if you're asking for something and the universe knows there's something better for you, it's not going to give you the thing you're asking for. So that said, if there is something in your world you want to manifest and you share it with us here, I'll put it up on that page too. You come back at least once a week, tell all your family and friends to come too. Read each name and the request up there. Because when you're doing that, the thought form becomes bigger and bigger and bigger with each time, with each person of what you want to manifest in your reality it will come to you sooner, again given that it is in your highest and best interest. So if you haven't done so already, you can go in over there, you give me your name and email, I will give you a copy of my book, How to Take Your First Steps on your spiritual path. If you haven't figured it out already, I think differently. 
and that's why I'm a metaphysical minister. Learn something new. Open your mind to new avenues. Isn't that why you're here anyway? I really appreciate your clicking like and share. And I will see you here next time. Take an action, something you've not done before, so you can get a result you've never had before. And in doing so, I wish you many, many blessings.